In recent years, several impressive mini-engines have emerged onto the automotive scene, with the in-engine being one of the most unique and promising designs. In this video, we'll delve into the history and innovations of opposed piston engines and explore whether the in-engine can stand up to the competition, including electric vehicles, EVs, A brief history of opposed piston engines. Opposed piston engines are not a new concept. They have been around since the 19th century, albeit in different forms. The basic idea is straightforward. They lack valves, cams, and camshafts, offering a simpler and more efficient design. Early versions often featured a dual crankshaft with complex synchronous gearing. One of the most notable opposed piston engines was the Junkers UMO205, developed in the 1930. It was employed in multiple aircraft and boasted 600 plus horsepower from its two-stroke, 12-piston design. However, it was soon overshadowed by newer radial engines and jet engines. Similarly, the Napier Deltec took the concept further with an 18-cylinder Delta configuration primarily used in naval craft and larger locomotives. It reached a formidable 1600 horsepower, but it had complexities and was later replaced by more efficient diesel engines. Resurrection of the opposed piston engine In recent years, the opposed piston engine has seen a resurgence, led by companies like Axitis Power. They've adopted a calculated approach using computational fluid dynamics to improve efficiency by iterative design in simulations. Engineers can measure critical parameters, identify potential issues, and fine-tune the design before building prototypes. One of their flagship models is a 10-liter engine with 400 horsepower and 1,600 pounds of torque. Notably, it meets emission standards for Class 8 trucks, making it a compelling alternative for heavy-duty applications. With the growing demand for electric trucks, where charging infrastructure and range remain concerns, the opposed piston engine seems to offer a potential solution. For instance, Walmart is testing Exciti's Powers engine and considering replacing heavier 13 and 15 liter engines in their fleet. Expanding possibilities. The impact of opposed piston engines might not be limited to trucks alone. The Iron N a parallel development is an intriguing concept. It could serve as a range extender for electric vehicles, reducing the number of batteries required, increasing range, and providing charging flexibility, challenging electric vehicles. While electric vehicles have made significant strides in recent years, there remain significant challenges. Electric trucks, like the Tesla Semi, require large battery packs which not only contribute to the depletion of rare materials like cobalt and nickel, but also entail long charging times. For heavy-duty trucks, extended charging times are impractical, and as a result, they are not ideal for long-haul applications. The opposed piston engine, with its potential to reduce the reliance on massive battery packs, could be a game-changer in this context. Using less battery material can be more sustainable and may help in overcoming the limitations of current EVs. The sustainability angle. One significant aspect of the opposed piston engine's resurgence is its potential to address environmental concerns. With a reduced reliance on large battery packs, the production and disposal of lithium ion batteries, which have their own environmental challenges, could be curtailed. This could contribute to more sustainable transportation solutions and align with global efforts to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. The opposed piston engine's revival is a testament to the ongoing innovation in the automotive industry. Its potential to challenge the dominance of electric vehicles is exciting, and only time will tell if it can carve out a significant place in the future of transportation. Share your thoughts and opinions on this topic, and stay tuned for more developments in the world of automotive technology. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more exciting content.